Welcome back. Uh, last time we had some pretty, I don't know, confusing games. Uh, I'm going to continue playing 10 minute games and see how I do uh, playing my best here. Um, try not to drop pieces like we did last time. Try not to sandwich my rook between my pawn and their pawn. See if I can activate both my rook and my bishop. Maybe bring a silver into the middle of the board and not forget to castle. We'll see if I can do some of these things correctly this time. Uh, should be exciting, no matter how it goes. Yeah. I was trying to tell a joke about punctuality, and how folks of different cultures um, will show up either exactly on time, or sometimes a bit late, or sometimes exactly the correct amount late. And I wonder where America falls. Good luck. Where America falls in that spectrum. I think there's some malaise. You should show up uh, somewhat late, but not, like, extremely late as an American. Um, wait. This looks familiar. <laughs> what do I do? Okay, we're gonna play fourth file rook. And hopefully not get murdered. Uh, so I'm defending against this. Wait. Um. Alright. Let's do it. Whoa, that was a cool avatar. Alright, wrong diagonal bishop. Um. Gosh. We got something being played today. Oh, if I take this, uh, I get this bishop drop 5-5 five five, uh, stings a bit. Uh, I might already be in severe trouble. I'm not sure. Um... I think this might be playable. So, I'm striking two of their pawns. Their rook and pawn are striking on this third file. Um, <laughs> Not sure about that. Uh, what to do? I guess we take here now, right? And take my free pawn. And things will be okay. Uh, yeah, I've defended my silver. I know it looks scary, but it's not. Unless I've missed some critical detail, in which case it's just game over. But I'm pretty sure I'm fine here. Um, they have nothing in hand, so, yeah, what's going on? Hmm. I mean, I could have pushed this pawn, but that didn't feel right here. I'm trying to set up my own bishop for some cool tactic. Um... So, their rook is not promoting this turn. Um, their rook is threatening this pawn. Hmm. Do I just ignore this and bring my silver out? And they pawn drop me, and I'm not sure. Whatever I do here, I want it to be accurate, but this looks a little tricky. Pawn drop, rook takes, um, bishop drop. Threatens this. Mm. 
7分。This looks right. If I try to get too creative, I don't think I have time for every move I want to play here. So, uh, we're going to approach the king. Right, so now they retreat. Um... Hmm. I have a feeling this could have had a more successful outcome had I played more accurately. So, where are their pieces going? This 5-5 five, five bishop is something. Um, if I push the pawn, if they promote, if I take... Yeah, no, they could sack for this. Oh, that's interesting. If they sack, I can pick up the promoted piece. There's no way that any of this is working, is there? Because my bishop drop picks up the rook over here. Um, they would need some really severe tactic to... Like, if they're sacrificing a bishop here uh, for my silver, then they promote here, I can take back rook takes, I drop bishop here, knight takes, promoted, bishop takes, right. So in all of these lines, I end up picking up the piece that's on the square. Um, it, right now I have to take it, but... <sighs> I'm confused. In fact, I don't even need to drop here. I could drop over there. Yeah, this is just crushing. So... Yeah, that, that's Go gotta on. sting just a bit. Um... Uh, so what do we do now? Maybe this check was more accurate after all. Hmm. My rook is not active. Wait, if I do nothing, they this dragon causes problems. Um, if I do nothing, they block. So we're going to pursue this in perhaps not a very effective manner. But we'll apply some pressure here. Right. So they do collect my bishop. Um, hmm. All right, we'll take this. And attempt not to get murdered. Um, <laughs>
So this was the follow-up I saw. And we just start exchanging pieces left and right. Okay, that is a bishop. Hmm. What to do? Nihun. So my silver traps their silver. This is not a place I would like to normally put my bishop, but I was just struggling to find a move here. Um... So I'm trying to pick up this silver here. Um... Ippun. I'm confused. Oh, okay, so yeah, I've allowed something quite dangerous here. Uh, it could be worse. Hmm. Right, we run for it. So this whole time I've been trying to like have that move land with tempo. Um and it has not really connected with tempo at all. 
But we had to play it anyway. Despite it being a tempo loss. So... Uh, okay, we'll take one of those. Good God, how do you do this? How do you checkmate? Oh my goodness. I was fortunate to find this. Thanks for the game. Ooh, that was exciting. Let's play another game. Really got our money's worth that game. <laughs> oh dear. Good luck. Oh, I get to go first. Let's let's enjoy this privilege. Whoa. Okay. Sure. Yes, please. This looks fun. One of us is going to have an active bishop. Oh, okay. <laughs> Um, that's possible, sure. I'm confused. Alright, let's take it. And go back. Sure. Um. Something happened to this game. Not sure exactly what happened, but it seems to be in my favor. All right. Um, how do I proceed here? Okay, their king looks safe ish. Um, This looks like a good file for a rook. So I'm threatening bishop trapping the rook. I'm also maybe threatening just promote my rook. Or just take the pawn. Uh, gotta say I didn't quite expect the game to open this way. So my rook is prone to this bishop fork if I'm careless. I need to exercise some caution here. Um, hmm.
Let's be a little bit careful. So protect some squares toward the center of the board. Still be open to the possibility of a bishop exchange, but don't drop my rook to some crazy fork. Um, this just defends against a wrong diagonal bishop that would hit this pawn. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, we're going to play some aggressive moves, and hopefully things will pay off. Uh, this defends against some crazy knight moves, I guess. Not that I'd expect crazy knight moves to profit, but just in case, we're trying to preempt that. One thing I'll have to be careful of is to not accidentally give away a pawn for nothing. Um... But if I can be a bit cautious, things should work out. Nanafun. Okay. Yeah, so... Yeah, we'll just play a normal game, I guess. My bishop's still hanging out on 5-5. Five five. All right, they've made a gap on the back row, which makes room for pieces, but... Um, I guess we're going to do something mildly crazy. Uh, okay. I could just take this pawn. That is possible here. Should I just take it? Um, no, we'll promote here. This feels like the right thing to do somehow. So even though this allows some modest counterplay, I think we're okay. My next thought is to force the silver to move. And once said silver moves, we promote. Um, hmm. All right. Forget that. Let's go back to this. And not let that bishop promote. So, no bishop takes lance today. Um, Go for me. This is so confusing.
I'm trying to evaluate, like, which of several moves is best. Swish Fun 5 5 is a monster. I can't just let that sit there. Um. So we're going to just gently run away, make sure we don't get murdered, and then come back and attack when we're ready. We have a bishop in hand, we have two pawns, and nowhere to place them because all the files have pawns everywhere. Uh, this is strange. But yeah, this rook is sad. Our rook is somewhat less sad. I could have done more aggressive things this game, but it just didn't feel necessary. We've played an Ishida all the way up the board here. Or rather, we got a rook and a knight in close proximity where the knight protects the rooks here. But also our rook's threatening to swing around a bit and have some fun. Um... Right. Wait, they've trapped their bishop. I don't think they did that on purpose. So my rook actually protects the square here. Um, All right, let's exchange a rook for two pieces and an attack. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. They made rook. They made room for their bishop. Um, missed that. Clever. All right. Well, this is one way for us to find something for our lance and rook to do. Uh, yeah? Okay. We're starting to build an initiative. Don't know whether to defend here. Um, okay, let's retreat. <sighs> this is tricky. Is this the correct moment for me to use my bishop? I have no idea. This might be exactly the wrong moment for me to use it. Um... I could be a uh, very, very mistaken in trying to do that. Um, so this gold is floating. That's cool, I guess. We built up a mega attack on the edge file. Um, Nifun Sanjibio. I guess this is appropriate. Just, 
this is for whatever reason I'm just having the worst time ever reading this position. Um Nifun. Part of it might be that I played a very irregular opening strategy and have no idea how to follow it up. That's probably almost all of why I'm extremely confused throughout this entire endeavor. Um, so that I've given myself a difficult position. Oh. Hang on. That was perhaps not well advised. Um, crap. Ippun Sanjubio. Right. I forgot this bishop defends this gold. So, we just keep sliding further and further into a terrible thing. Um, but I will get active pieces. I will start collecting knights eventually. Hopefully I don't get mated before my pieces activate somehow. Uh, yeah. Um... Amateur shogi is fun to watch, isn't it? Forget they get a pawn. Sanjibio. Pawn's annoying. Um. Nijibio. I have no idea what to do. As usual. Right. 
run. Run, run, run. It's too, that's unfortunate. Bummer. Yeah, the game got interesting. Oh well. We got time for one more game. We are getting our money's worth today. Good luck. I forgot to thank my last opponent. Thank you for that last game. Alright. Uh, looks like we have another fighting game today. <laughs> Holy moly. Um, wait, wait, wait. Is there an improvement already? Isn't this the one where I could push the pawn and they just have a very hard time defending it right off the bat? Um, mm, I'm not sure. All right, we'll play a more normal game. Um, That's curious. All right, we have time for this. Oh boy. Uh, we get, we're getting all the interesting moves today. Um. Well, that's a lovely shape. I'm not sure how it's going to hold water against my attack. Um, but it'll be interesting to find out. Um... That surprises me. What is their plan here? I don't get it. What's the plan? This is confusing. If the plan is to confuse me, that plan works, but at what cost? Um...
7分I don't understand. Something ain't right. Um... Thanks for the game. Not sure if I've missed a lot of things that game. Um, but we're slowly ranking our way up. Yeah, we got our money's worth today for those three games. Holy moly. Uh, we actually saw some things, so that's an improvement. Um, yeah. I'll have to review some of these games at a later point. That was... Wow, 4,473 wins, 4,451 losses. That, that's quite a record. That's saying you've played a lot. So, I'm, I want to look up some of this player's other games. <laughs> the way they played looks quite interesting. Um, yeah. I think in my last two games a lot of things i probably missed because it was quite complicated but anyway very thankful to all three of my opponents for these exciting games and i hope you all enjoyed this as well uh we're coming back we're gonna make our way to one don sometime uh so yeah thanks for watching